Hello and welcome back to me playing Shadows of Arm Extra Small for the... The... I don't know what day this is supposed to be for. Now this was actually for the 6th. Oh, the previous episode was supposed to be for the 3rd. Uh, never mind that. Last time we got a shimmering glow of spherical lightningness and whatnot. Which apparently protects me from all magical damage. Oh my god, everybody's attacking everybody here. Fair enough. We're just gonna kill everybody and we're gonna be happy. Actually, this half of the party doesn't need to attack. Minsk can flower and do the job nicely. Oh no! Nalia! Before you go do something crazy, cast that spell. There you go. So Nalia now should be fine in theory. In relative theory, she should be. I'm gonna lower the volume of the game one moment. Uh, where is the... Ah. We're attacking no one. Uh, Minsk? Attack that. Lauron, attack that guy. There you go. Is Lauron going to survive this encounter? God knows. I hope so. Minsk, attack that guy. Yes, he is. He's fine. Well, that was a long battle. Tendious battle, mostly, because there is nothing important going on. I'm gonna rest. I'm lazy to heal up with spells. We have time now. Well, according to the game, not really, but we have time, trust me. I think Bioware didn't want to hazard the game so much as they, as the uh, old uh, interplayer, Black Isle, did with old Fallout games, where you had like, huh, return to chip in 300 days or we're all gonna die. I think it was actually 150 days, but uh, you get the point. Point is, you don't want to have timers in games. Although, I don't know, I myself would like, enjoy some timers sometimes. Sometimes some timers can come, with br can bring much joy into one's heart. You half, you're just gonna stay there. You guys are going to attack those guys. In one, can you cast any animal? No, you can cast a fireball. Might as well. You can cast spiders. Will you do that then? And you, can you do something pretty? Ah, not really. Might as well just... Kill them with magic. There you go. These two sword spiders now should annihilate, hopefully, these two rebels. Nice and easy. Oh my god, there's plenty of rebels around here. Well, apparently Minsk can deal with that problem. Can these two spiders actually deal with this rebel? Probably, yes. They can. Ewan helped a bit too. Good to know. Help Minsk, please, here. Thank you. Okay, that's it. Let's go on. I do like this place, but... Ah, you have the orb, surface creature. This means only that the most sacred Sen Senitili could have given it to you. She has, she has sent us the word of your intentions. Do you wish to be brought to the most honorable villainity? Vil Villinati? Villinati, sorry. He who, ha who has saved us. I am willing to lead you to him, surface beast. I am not a beast, you are a beast. Uh, yes, take me to this prince of yours. Excellent, follow me then. It is not far from here. Okay. Let's go and see him, at least. Ah, so it seems the surface creatures have we have heard so much about have finally come to us. Uh, are these the uh, uh, the ones that your mother spoke of? Salini Savedatelil? Yes, ah, they are. Most honorable villainity. I'm gonna call him Villanity simply because I feel like the Villanity is the right way to say it. The most sacred Sanity lady was the mo mo was more specific in her description. Ha! I did not think the description had to be all that specific. As if they would have been anyone else, ugly as they are. Their flesh is so pale and scaleless. My skin may not have scales, but it has seen many suns come and go. Boo thinks you could use some sun too. Then you might not smell as much as like wet laundry. <sighs> but your hideous appearance means little. As does this nonsense about Sakala sending you. As a silent little <laughs> and her mother seems to believe so strongly in. What matters is that the Met Ilak Saxon Tokal says you said has sent yourself as being beings beings oh my god. Beings to collect my heart, 
He is so certain to your success that now is the perfect time to strike. We have a heart, surface half elf, a heart that you can return to exactly and claim the Asvelanity. The guard of the city of caverns will be down as we will be able to strike. Do not attack any guard. This will tip off Ilexarticutokal to your treachery. Wait for our attack, then launch your own assault to the, on the king and his baron. I will come as soon as I can. Once Ilexarticutokal and Tatsixontikal are there, I shall take the throne of the city of caverns. The madman, this, the madman shall be and shan't be ended seriously shall be dead and the city of caverns shall be saved with the return of the exiled blood yes yes whatever the throne is what is important here so sir for secretary assuming that you're capable of intelligence capable of intelligence thought oh yeah thought do you agree to this plan or shall we be forced to engage in simple slaughter uh I agree to your plan, I shall return to the king with your fake heart. Maybe you are intelligent enough for a surface species. Take the, this heart and bring it to Ishka I shall set my, up my forces and prepare for this attack. This is the only way to save our people, half elf. I pray that you are indeed the one promised by Sekola, and that we shall all meet with success. Okay. Oh, hi there. Work. Oh, they're just dying all over the place. Royal Priestess? Senitili dead? She died? Oh no, that's not nice. Ah, oh, Too bad. Let's just move out. Sorry for being a bit sloppy right now, I'm just tired. I really am. I had a recording session of, well, what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight episodes so far of things that for my channel. I don't know, taking vacation for uh, my channel sometimes actually causes you to become even more tired. I should have started working maybe earlier, not two days ago actually. It has been my silliness actually that caused this. So the High Priestess died. Why is that? I don't know. It doesn't really matter, does it? No, no, no it doesn't. hey oh, Oh! It is my surface, half elf. Come to me once again. And does it have? Why, yes, I think I smelled the icon of a rebel. You have the card with you? Yes, 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 yes. I knew this was coming. Yes, I did. My men reported your return, and I asked Sekola if it was done, and he told me that it was. So I sacrificed a few hatchlings and a guard to the shark father, and I had the rest of the guards prepare for the festival. There will be a feast tonight. Not that, I, that we were planning on fishing on you, my favorite little half-elf. No, no. You weren't planning on eating my half-elf, were you, Baron? Uh, no. No, I wasn't planning on it, Miles Honorable Ixaltotakatokal. Liar. I heard you talking earlier. So be a good Baron and get the reward for my little half-elf here. It was certainly deserved. Oh, yes. Most exalted one, alarm, alarm! The rebels, the prince, they have crept into the city of Kevins and they are attacking. What? You, you have betrayed me, my half elf. This cannot be. I told you the surface beast could only could not be trusted. Oh, shut up! Tell us, just kill them, kill them all. Kill them all? No, I didn't say all. I didn't say ah, whatever. I want all of their heads on my plate. Why is it that the, 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 the sea creatures always want to eat people? No wonder then everybody has hydrophobia or something. I mean, come on! Everybody wants... Ah, whatever. Hey! Just came in time with the party, when everybody's already dead. Go figure. Okay, they're dead. All done. Ugh. <sighs> Ah, yes. So now I'm the king of the city caverns. The mad tyrant is dead and we can well we are well rid of him. Is he actually talking? I can hear him. And we are well rid of him. May Sekalak gnaw upon his bones for an eternity. You have done our people a great service, half-elf. Uh, 
Okay, then perhaps then you even know. With Ixelis Tokal dead, the exiles can now return to the city of caverns where once our people grew weak. Now they can become strong again. Truly, I found the story of entropy working its slow decay upon an entire people to have much more poetry. With any luck, these creatures will stumble into the downward spiral again soon. <coughs> I wouldn't say that. Their blood will return to the mix with the old, and only together can we protect... What was that? Protect our city from the advances of the Illithid and the Drow. Except the Kotakal was too mad to see what was he was doing. And now the city of Cavern is saved. The prophecy is completed. Even if not quite the way that the Pale Eel thought it would be, eh? We owe you a debt, Halthef. We are unfamiliar with your kind, but you are welcome amongst us. And you did more than was well, than was asked, bearing the brunt of that battle. For that, I give you the first spoils of war. Take the treasury key from East Central to Kyle Corps. Use it to enter the city treasury and take what you will. I am feeling generous today. To enter the Underdark, you will need this magic rope from the King's Corps. Use it to go down the pate behind my former throne. Thank you. He was actually short of... What was that message? Oh, gold has been placed in your key. Makes sense. Anyway, I'm gonna pause this right now, and I'm gonna take a break from recording stuff right now. For the next 11 days, no no less. For me personally, not for you. I'm gonna be back recording stuff the 12th of uh, Jan February. So thanks for watching, and join me next time as we will go to the Underdark. Until then, be well! Bye! This was the Loud and Gaming Show! Thanks for watching!